There are a lot of 3D software out there and most of them are not easy to use. So today we've got a list of easy and simple 3D software for you if you want to create your own 3D models without having a lot of experience. This list of 3D software is focused on accessibility, ease of use, so as a result we're going to see different applications for these software but they are great as a start or as an introduction to 3D. Number 1. Mesh Mixer Mesh Mixer is a free 3D software from Autodesk for beginners that allows you to do animation, modeling, 3D sculpting, and surface stamping. Mesh Mixer has a lot of tools and we will mention some of them here. It can create 3D patterns and lattices, and it has an advanced selection of tools including brushing, surface lasso, and constraints. It can remash or simplify the mesh you are working on. It can do smoothing and freeform deformation, which is some strong modifiers that exist in 3ds Max, which is also a product of Autodesk. It can do hole filling, bridging, boundary zippering, and or repair of pre-existing models that you modify to make your own models. Since this software is from Autodesk, they also implemented some other tools that exist, such as extrusions, offset surfaces, and project to target surface. Interior tubes and channels, precise 3D positioning with pivots, automatic alignment of surfaces. It is so simple you can learn most of it by just playing around and if you want to learn more about it there are a few tutorials that you can check them out. You can search them online and you're gonna find plenty that are gonna help you to get a solid grip on this software. Number two 3D Slash. 3D Slash is a type of 3D modeling software produced by Sylvain Hue. 3D Slash software offers an original and intuitive experience to 3D model with ease. 3D Slash develops its concept on pre-assembled cuboids of different sizes from 1 unit to 1024 units, according to the Octree model. Inspiration for 3D Slash came from kids playing on Minecraft and the easy way they develop sophisticated 3D models without having a lot of trouble and having fun doing it. However, 3D Slash is specifically meant for designing 3D printable objects in relation with the stone cutter metaphor. Therefore, it provides an original 3D Slash toolset such as the hammer to remove cuboids, the trowel to add cuboids, and the chisel to remove slices, the brush to set the color, the wood filter to add a slice of cuboids, the milling machine to remove adjacent cuboids, the picture projection on cuboids to help cutting your object out according to the picture shape. 3D Slash provides a 3D modeling unique solution for non-designer mass market audience ages from 5 to 95, do-it-yourself trends and their concrete production thanks to 3D printing. So this software is actually trying to target a bigger audience because it's easy to use and it's, it's not going to be highly technical that's why a lot of people are going to find it appealing. On the other hand, 3D Slice is an easy handling rapid prototyping solution for entrepreneurs and makers community. Number 3 Vectory Now more and more programs are dedicated to providing a wider audience access to 3D modeling tools. While many 3D programs are expensive or require high-end computers, a startup from Slovakia is hoping to teach the masses with their new cloud-based 3D design tool named Vectory. If you can find a 3D modeling software that is easy enough for you and you think that most 3D modeling programs are hard, then probably you want to check out Vectory. You can model any model you want easily. You can also load plugins. For example, you can use the Google Fonts plugin to generate 3D text. While 3D modeling, you can add in a mirror plugin to help you make a character model without having to model the whole thing from scratch. So you can only model one half and the other part is going to be taken care of using this plugin. Models are saved in the cloud where they are accessible through any modern browser. No device configuration is necessary. Not only users can easily access their creations, but they can also share their models from anywhere. Number 4. Tinkercad. Tinkercad is a free online collection of software tools that can help people to create simple 3D models in a simple and fast manner. Tinkercad was founded by Kai Beckman and Miko Monomen in 2011. It brought the first browser-based 3D design platform to the masses. 
Tinkercad is the largest community of design and 3D printing enthusiasts of its kind, and its uniqueness has so far attracted over 7 million users. In June 2013, Tinkercad became part of the Autodesk family of apps. This news came shortly after the announcement of Tinkercad's shutdown by previous owners. Active community of Tinkercad has created over 50 million 3D designs since the beginning of Tinkercad. Number 5. Morphe Morphe is an easy to learn 3D design software on iPad, Mac, and Windows for all people who don't have a design experience and for beginners. It can be used to create plugins for AR and VR, 3D printing, animation, game design, design thinking, storytelling, graphic design, and more. You can draw 3D models in many ways, sketching, basic drawing, symmetry, revolving lines, erasing lines, and more. This software comes with augmented reality, AR, placing, editing, plus viewing to the images and video built in. It also has image and video texturing tools for rendering purposes. Number 6. Leopoly this is a 3D modeling and 3D printing cloud-based software. It runs on a browser and its aim is to serve a digital content. The basic concept of the platform is to provide people, companies, and end users with digital object creation tools to take advantage of 3D printing. The Lego Poly platform also offers the opportunity to personalize pre-made digital models as well as self-modeling. On the website, users can save, download, or order their physical models in the cloud through the integrated 3D printer providers. The following modeling tools are available also. Organic modeling, Boolean operations, digital engraving and embossing, parametric modeling, color texturing, and more. Number 7. FreeCAD FreeCAD is a free and open source general purpose parametric 3D modeler and a building information modeling software. FreeCAD is intended for mechanical product design, but also expand to a wide range of uses around engineering such as architecture or electrical engineering. Users can only interact with this software because of the free and open source nature of the software. Users can also extend the functionality of the software using a Python programming language. Of course, this is something hard and probably most people are going to find this extremely difficult, but right now we're, we're talking about possibilities that this software can offer and if you are extreme beginners or a complete newbie, then this is something that you need to stay away from because it's going to hurt your brain. As with many modern 3D CAD modelers, it will have a 2D component to facilitate 3D to 2D drawing conversion. Direct 3D drawing is not the focus for this software, neither the animation or 3D model manipulation like Blender or Maya. However, the modular nature of FreeCAD will allow you to use and adapt its workflow to any environment that you're going to need to adapt to. Number 8. Mendelbob 3D It is a free software application created for 3D fractal imaging, developed by Jess and a group of Fractal Forums contributors based on Daniel White and Paul Nylander's Mendelbob's work. This software formulates dozens of nonlinear equations into an amazing range of fractal objects. The 3D rendering environment includes lighting, color, specularity, depth of field, shadow and glow effects, allowing the user fine control over the imaging effect. Mendelbob 3D has a devoted following of users worldwide with the online communities on DeviantArt and Facebook, where artists share their creations as well as fractal formulas and software tips. This software is more user-friendly than most 3D fractal applications and a number of tutorials are available online. Number 9. Cora Cora is an open source 3D printer slicing application. It was created by David Bram, who was later employed by Ultimaker, a 3D printing manufacturing company to maintain the software. Cora is available under the LGPLv3 license. Ultimaker Cora is used by over 1 million users worldwide, and it handles 3 million print jobs every week. It is one of the preferred 3D printing software for Ultimaker 3D printers. And of course, you can use it for other printers as well. Number 10, Safcad. 
SouthCAD is an online computer-aided design software for 3D modeling and printing released in 2016. It is a browser-based and cloud-based software. SouthCAD is a polygon mesh-based design program. There are three common design formats that are solid, surfaces, and mesh. So in this video, we talked about 10 programs that have different level of difficulty, but in the end, they are very suitable for people who don't have a lot of experience. So I hope you're going to try some of these software and check them out and see for yourself how you're going to find these based on the experience you're going to have and the time you're going to spend using these pieces of software. I hope you found this video informative and useful and if you want to share with us your thoughts you can do this in the comment section below. Also you can check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much and I will see you in the next one.